Right guys, they wouldn't deem you a shooter, it always like it took me a while to get used to this one and it's it's mainly for arcade like gun games where you can play four guns up to one time because you know conventionally um you can't have more than one mice or mouse I should say mice um so this site here where you shoot gives you like the launch how to launch the games it'll all come clear in a minute so I'm looking for gyro attack 4 this is one I haven't done yet and I've got all the codes here shows you what you've got to put in so I'm just going to put this one in because each one of them has a different launcher for demu shooter so it's this one here I'm going to have to have a look at that minigun I and I open the game make sure you have JBS enabled zero and gunnable zero but it will tell me that anyway when it doesn't launch so that's the main thing I need and then demu shooter the last latest one is 12.7 which I've already downloaded so we're going to keep this handy and this is my gyro attack 4 so my demu shoot is here I'm just going to drag it all across you don't need it all but I'm just going to drag it all across right so first of all what we've got to do is open demu shooter GUI or GUI as people say and you've got to find your light guns so my device gun one is the second one up from the bottom as you see my guns moving and my other one player two configuration is third up from the bottom so both of them are working so save config okay so team you shooter you have to run this as administrator so properties right click go to properties compatibility run this program as administrator apply and okay right now first of all I'm going to make a simple file so I can launch Demu Shooter and the game at the same time so pardon me don't need that start then you just go copy then you need decode Ooh. which is that one paste that in start game.exe Right now we go to file, save as, <coughs> geoattack 4, and here we want,
you have to save it as a bin file so you got you put it as all files then dot bin no bat twat <laughs> bin dot bat right save Can't even bloody spell the name, man. Right now, it should launch both. Mm. Right, that works. So now, what I'm going to do? I've got a little program called. Right now you have advanced back to exe. Right, so all you got to do get the guy attack full bat file, drop it in there. Then you go to build exe. I found that sometimes you put it into the actual game, it disappears. So I'm going to do it into desktop. So. G A I A attack four then save and that's it done. So now I'm going to put the exe in here. Then I'm going to send to desktop create shortcut I don't need that one anymore right so now we have guy attack 4 I'm going to go to properties right click properties change icon just tells you you haven't got one so I'm going to browse to the game folder which I've already had it set up anyway oh no that's guy attack 4 sorry Gyro Tech 4 ICO yeah. open OK apply OK so that's how you set up DMU Shooter and you have to do it per game and then there you go Why'd you game do Lally? Ah, might be because I have to go back to JCONFIG. It did say uh, Mini Gun I and I. And that one has to be gun num fake zero. Gonna back it up in case. GBS enable zero, gunnable zero. Zero. And what's it one? Gun. Uh, 
Right. Let's try again then. I was lucky. So there you go guys, that's how to set that up. File save. And what I'll do, in case, you know, my guns break or something, I'm gonna back up that one. So that's how you set that up. I might do another one for you just so you get the gist of it. You know, guys, I was being sick earlier with a capital F. Really was. <laughs> I was thinking, what the hell is this not working? I've got to set up my light gun, don't I? So I'm doing the Haunted Museum now. So first of all, I'll drag over Demu Shooter. Right, so the first thing you do is make sure it's on, which it looks like it, on run this program as administrator, yeah, so that's fine. Right, first of all we set up the guns, this is why I was having a thick time with capital F earlier. <laughs> so, run, device one, mine second one up. Third one up for me, second gun. Save config. Okay. So now we're gonna go over to Notepad again. Get rid of. Oh, no. So, first of all, we're gonna have. Copy that. Copy. Right, so we want to start. XC. Then you have to leave a space. And remember, we have to find this one here. So you want to copy, copy the target. Copy. And put that into there. And we want to go start and it's just game.exe and we go to file save as moldy in here so entered museum And remember save it as a bat file so dot 
BAT. You have to have that on all files. And go to save. All right, let's make sure that works. Yeah, that's working. Right, now we're going to convert it to an EXE. I'm going to go to me. Don't need that one now. I was, that's when I was having a sick a minute earlier. So, tools. Advance back to EXE. Drag that across. Build EXE at the top here. Build EXE. Wanted museum. Save. All right, now we'll leave it into there. Then I'm going to make a shortcut to put an icon on. Right click, send to desktop, create shortcut. Then I'm going to oh, properties, change icon, browse my icons there, which is in the game folder. Open, OK, apply, OK. I don't need that one. So now we should be good to go. Still got to get rid of my mouse on the screen. So I might be able to um, right, but that's the gist of it, guys. I'll see how I can get rid of me um, mouse on the screen in a second. It might be enough. I'll have a look at that in a minute because there will be a way of getting rid of it. So I hope you enjoyed anyway, guys. Cheers.